One of the brothers charged in the fatal shooting of Chicago police officer Ella French appeared in court today. WGN's Sean Lewis is live at the Cook County Criminal Courts building with more. We'll actually get to him in just a few moments. Northwestern University has suspended fraternity activities following reports of people drugged without consent at on-campus gatherings. Judy Wang is live in Evanston at Northwestern with more. Judy. Good morning. The suspension of activities applies to all fraternities on campus, and that includes recruitment and alumni events. University police are investigating two reports of students drugged at two separate fraternity houses. All fraternity activities suspended until at least October 17th. Most students we spoke with say it was the right move. I think it's the start of a solution, but I think we're a long way off in terms of having something that both the student body will be accepting of. As they're figuring out what's best, I think that's the right move. Um, so I think it's right that they limited it to a month for now while they figure out what the right plan is. Saturday, university police say someone reported being drugged during a gathering at Sigma Alpha Epsilon in the 2300 block of Sheridan Road. The previous day, police received reports that the same thing had happened at Alpha Epsilon Pi in the 500 block of Lincoln Street. I think the problems that occurred are pretty persistent across Greek life. So I think it's a it's a good move to kind of do what they can to prevent more people from being unsafe. A crime notice sent to students states their health, safety and well-being are top priority and Northwestern is taking the allegations very seriously. About 200 students protested outside the fraternities Sunday night. They demanded the school abolish Greek life. I ain't here to spread uh, hate towards any of the people living in this building. I don't know anything about them. To me, they're just folks who wanted to have a good time in college, uh, you know, doing the things that college kids do. What I'm hoping comes out of this is some sort of systemic reform. Students who protested say they also want a forum on campus so they can share their concerns directly with university administrators. University police are asking anyone who might have information that will help in the investigation to come forward. On the Northwestern University campus in Evanston, Judy Wang, WGN News.